Hi friends, let's see one more application on PIC microcontroller which is stepper motor control by using PIC 16F A77A controller and I'll show you how to put on produce simulation tool. So this is your MPLAB IDE and just follow the steps to create a project. Just choose project tab and select the option project wizard and click on next and here you can choose your microcontroller which microcontroller you are trying to work so this IDE specially designed for only pick families it doesn't support any other atmel or any other families so it's a individual ID so now I am I just selected pick 16f a double seven a and click on next and this will ask you which compiler you are trying to use. So for microchip IDE, there are many compilers, CCS, Hi-Tech, and Pixie. There are many tool shoots are available to, to compile your embedded C programs for PIC families. Now I just installed Hi-Tech Universal Tool Shoot. And choose your compiler name and click on next. and then so it will ask you where you are trying to create your project so you can create your own folder on its local drive i just created local disk d pick so here because you need to browse your hex file from this path so i'm just giving the project name as stepper motor and click on save next next and finish so now up to now you just created a project with the target device pic 16f 877a now you need to open editor to write a program for that go file tab and choose option new so this is the text editor here you can type your program So I am just defining my hardware lines as lead 1 to RD0. There are 4 leads for your bipolar stepper motor, lead 2 RD1, lead 3 RD2 and lead 4 d3 so these are the hardware declarations i'm giving with this and then main starts from here so i'm taking one temporary variable to give the delay between uh, coils which is v1 to configure your port as output or input, you need to use TRIS register in PIC families. So the least significant bits of port D, I am trying to configure it as output so that I need to assign logic 0 for that. So remaining MSB bits are input. So I am using only 4 LSB bits of port D. So LSB bits of port D configured as output. And the value of port D initially I am making zeros here. So this is my initial declaration. Now I am taking one infinite loop is file of one so lead one logic i am trying to make it one and the other three leads l2 l3 and l4 of stepper motor assigning to zeros 
and you need to provide some time delay between each step of your motor so i am taking self for loop to generate a time delay and then so lead one logic zero and lead two logic is one and the two other leads logics are zeros and again you need to provide time delay so which is self for loop and later l1 l2 logic zeros and l3 logic is one L4 logic is zero. So this is for each step. You have to go with the clockwise logics. So this is how your motor rotates clockwise in continuous manner. So after writing program on editor window, go file tab and choose the option save. And I'm giving same name as program, but the program should be saved with .c extension. And then you have to compile this program for the select your source files on project window and right click and choose the option add files. So now my program name is stepper motor and click it and click on open. So to check errors and warnings of this program go project you can click on build option or else you can choose this build option. So your program should terminate with a new line and trish d is 0x at 0 mod ox00. So any modification you are doing click on save and build it. semicolon yes. so my program build successfully so now you can proceed with your hardware simulation by using produce so here you have to choose your components what you are trying to select pick 16f a double seven a is the controller and you need to take one driver IC so I am taking four channel driver and stepper motor which is bipolar now just place your controller and choose the driver IC L293D and stepper motor. And do the proper connections with the driver IC as ground. And the four inputs you have to go with this port D from the big controller. and enable and power pins are given to power so this power and ground you can get it from terminals
the corresponding output pins you have to go with the leads of stepper motor and after designing your hardware then you have to double click on microcontroller to browse the hex file where you created your project click on this folder symbol and go with local disk d and choose your folder name as pic and the hex file is stepper motor and then click on ok and you can play your output simulation you can watch clearly this step angle of your motor as 90 degrees 180 and 270 and 360 so each time you are just changing the logics as sequence 1 triple 0 0 1 double 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 0 1 so this is how for each time it is making 90 degrees angle of your step of motor so this is the way you can simulate your output for your direction if you are trying to rotate anti-clockwise just reverse your logic from program first make sure l4 has one and other three leads are zeros so you have to come for anti-clockwise direction this is your simple program to control your stepper motor clockwise direction thanks for watching